If you do enough of anything in the Sea of Thieves, you're bound to find yourself getting accommodation for your efforts. And within that large pool of accommodations, I'm going to talk about some of the hardest to get accommodations that will turn heads if you have them. Now, it's also worth mentioning that within this list, I'm not going to include exclusive legendary titles for completing factions, reaching a max level on anything, and no longer obtainable titles. But everything else is fan game within the list. Now, if I don't mention a title that you think is the hardest to get, let me know down in the comments section below. And like and subscribe if you do want to see more videos like this in the future. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the obvious one. First of all on the list, we have the Legendary Hunter of the Shrouded Ghost. Why is this on the list? Well, when was the last time you seen a Shrouded Ghost? We've spoken about how rare they are on the Sea of Thieves in a previous video, so I'm not going to go on to that matter. But honestly, getting the Legendary Hunter of the Sea of Thieves is one of the rarest titles, and it will always turn heads and raise questions if you are seen with the title. This fits on the list perfectly because it is based on luck and ultra hard to get given Shrouded Ghosts rarely ever spawn. Next up, we have the Legend of Buried Treasures, or in other words, the Beholder of Buried Treasures. To get this, you will need to complete all Buried Treasure commendations in the Build Rat section. Now, these commendations are a fine line between extreme luck and heavy grinding, from burying some valuable treasure with another crew on the same island, all the way over to sitting on an island in the Devil's Roar while a volcano erupts. You'll need to do everything few and far between to unlock this title, and it is really one of the grindiest and luckiest commendations to get. Next on the list, we have the title that would probably be in every single person's list when you ask them what the hardest commendations to get are, and that is the Legendary Hunter of the Sea of Thieves. For this, you'll need to complete absolutely every commendation in the Hunter's Call. From treacherous plunder to ruby splash tails, you better believe you'll be grinding hard to get this one. Most of the time, you'll find that getting Legendary Hunter of the Sea of Thieves is a longer and slower process than getting Pirate Legend itself. On top of the lengthy grind that is needed to complete this commendation, you'll also need to be at the right place in the right time, where some of them involve getting fish that are ultra rare in ultra rare situations, like being on a shipwreck within a storm. Not only that, you won't have to do this just once or twice, you'll have to do it up to 20 or more times over in each location, making it a sure contender for everyone's list when you talk about the hardest to get titles and commendations. Moving on to the final one of this list, we have the Seeker of Grand Adventure. To unlock this title, you'll need to complete every one of the original nine tool tales in 100% entirety. That includes all the journals, doing them five times over, and of course, just finishing the tool tales. Although this isn't a lucky commendation like the rest of them that we've mentioned on the list, it's a heavily grind focus commendation that'll take you weeks on end in some cases to unlock. However, the plus side with this commendation is completing it will also get you the gold curse, which is without a doubt one of the most sought after items in the Sea of Thieves. And it makes sense really, put a rare item behind a really hard to get commendation. But nevertheless, I figured I'd make this video into a short list of four and they were my four choices of the hardest to get commendations in the Sea of Thieves. If you do have any commendations that I've missed and you want to mention, please put them down in the comment section below as I would love to read them. Do you agree with my list? Do you disagree? Let me know. All responses are welcome. With all of that being said, hopefully you guys have a great night, evening, afternoon, morning, or whatever it is, wherever you are around the world. And I'm going to catch you all in the next one. Goodbye for now.